it, buddy. You're not drowning. Good job. Yeah, and that's been his reaction. He fell right on time. Uh, I'm legally blind. But here I am, baby. Sun still delivered. I'm young. <laughs> What's up, hopefuls, and welcome to another vlog. Today, me and baby Brooks are at a swim park. He got invited to a birthday party, and this is his very first time in the pool. So, of course, we had to share it with the family. And um, don't mind the 4K. It is going to be 4 k but right now, y'all are in a Ziploc sandwich bag just in case my phone fell. It needed a chance to live. But anyway, let's get into today's vlog. Hi guys, we are currently at, I think it's pronounced Bethesda, Bethesda Aquatic Center, yeah, alright, and we're at an indoor water park, this is located in Lawrenceville, Georgia, and I'll just give y'all a quick little overview, this is what it looks like. Forgive my phone if it looks um, real like blurry because I got my phone inside of a, a Ziploc bag. So don't judge me. But this is Baby Brooks' first time at a real swimming pool. He loves bath time. So I figured he would like swimming as well. So this is his first time in a pool and he doesn't really know how to feel about it. He likes being in the water because every hour they do, every hour they do a 15 minute break. And so on the 15 minute break, that's when of course he falls out because he wants to get back in the water. But he doesn't really like exploring the water too much without me holding his hand. So I'm gonna see if he tries to venture out a little more this time. So the side that we're on, it's made for children his age. So it starts right there at the beginning at zero feet. And it's a walk-in area. And it just, uh, it goes from zero to one feet. If you go all the way to the end of it, that's one, one foot. So over on this little side, He's already fallen a couple times. <laughs> He's already fallen a couple of times. And oh, there it goes. Come on. Come on, you got it. You got it, buddy. You're not drowning. Good job. Yeah, and that's been his reaction. He fell right on time. Uh, I'm legally blind. So this is about around the, the height that he likes for me to hold his hand. So I'm gonna hold it. He started to go up this little, these stairs right here, but it's a splash pad. It's a splash pad when you get to the third step and the water keeps getting in his eye. So then he just, he turns around and comes back. Ha <laughs> 
So yeah, as y'all can see, whoop, there he goes. He beat the dust that time, y'all. So anyway, I'm gonna cut the camera back off. Look, 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 I'm jumping back in. I'm gonna cut the camera off so that I can really hold his hand and pay attention. I don't want him falling in this water too much. But I just wanted to capture this memory. So we will talk to you guys in a minute. Bye. Is my box of uh, alcohol wipes down there on the bottom of that table? The, a little white box? Yeah. Let me wipe it all off. I'll be right back. <laughs> all right. I am biggity back. Sorry. <laughs> Um, that's what I was in the middle of about to tell y'all. Baby Brooks been asleep ever since um, I hung up with y'all last. So um, that put me in a great space to be able to take my eldest child. I had to take him to work. And then once I got back, I still had time to edit another vlog. So, um, all right. He done woke up talking trash. Um, but yeah, so I'm another video down. Y'all know I told y'all I'm several videos behind. So, um, I'm, I've been doing good though, catching up. I done got like, I don't know. I think I'm like four or five videos already in. So y'all will definitely be having some dedicated vlogs dropping back to back because they're already, um, they're already edited and done and all they doing is waiting to go live. So love that for me but um i'm gonna have to put the laptop to the side for now because um i forgot that the county that i live in is actually throwing a trunk or treat today so um i asked lana did she want to go she said she wasn't interested in going which i thought she was because i think last year she actually wanted to trick or treat or whatever but um I know you passed out candy, but you yeah. wanted to go trick-or-treating, right? No. Oh, well, she's such a hermit child. But I'm um, definitely going to take baby Brooks because um, the weather is nice outside today. That's why um, the view is looking how it's looking because the sun is coming in so bright that it's making the video do some stuff. But anyway. Good. Yeah. So, um, yeah, I'm going to put me on some clothes and try to look decent. My hair is so toe up that it's definitely not going to be giving cute. But I just try to do something with my edges, put some lashes on and look like a human being. And then he's already had his costume. His aunt, um, Tanisha, bought his costume, I don't know, probably about a month ago at this point. Um, she's always, any holiday, she's going to always find him something to wear for it. Um, last year she had his, she bought his Halloween costume. She bought his Thanksgiving, um, outfit. She bought his Christmas outfit and a Christmas costume. Like she don't play about the holidays. She don't play about the holidays. So yeah, he's been had his costume for a minute now. So Today will give him a, a reason to put it on, which actually works out great for me because since I'm taking him out today to do this little trunk or treat, and he also is having a little event at his daycare. So um, I'll take him to that. I'll take him to the daycare. And then um, on Halloween day, he'll be home. We'll be able to stay home and pass out candy. So that actually works out really, really well. So... Yeah, I am getting ready to get up, get us dressed, and we will pick y'all up once we get to the event.
just got it on. Hi, Nathan. Hi, Nathan Brooks. Let me turn the light on so you can see Grandma. Hey, Nathan. 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 Hey,
just go take a picture in front of this pumpkin patch and that's it for you. After nine o'clock, she can't call me. After me no hear ya, yeah. After me no hear ya, yeah. She better know say. After certain time, don't contact me, yeah. Hey y'all, it's night time, so I know y'all probably ain't gonna be able to see me worth a nothing, but. Here I am, baby. Sun still delivered. I'm yours. And tonight, <laughs> I am on my way to a Halloween party, y'all. This is my first official Halloween party. Um, a couple of years back, maybe like. Y'all, I can't tell if this is the police that just pulled up behind me. So, if I drop the phone, lower the phone a little bit, like I'm doing right now, it's only because I can't really tell who that is behind me. But, um, yeah, y'all, I'm on my way to my very first Halloween party. Maybe three, four years ago. Yeah, it had to be about four years ago because me and baby been together for five years now. So, yeah, I think it was like 2019, something like that. Um... I, my co-worker had like a little Halloween get together at his house but it wasn't necessarily a party like oh hold on y'all <laughs> sorry about that y'all the guest of honor whoop that is not me somebody nope that is not me look this little if that is the police behind me he probably ready to um pull me over at this point because i was about to go on red but anyway y'all let me see if i can get a peepsy nope that's not him thank you jesus okay so anyway um like i was saying this is my very first halloween party um, I went to a Halloween gathering about three or four years ago. My coworker had one, but that he didn't have like a DJ or nothing like that. And it was really for you to bring your kids. But this is a all adult Halloween party. So I am excited. Um, Carisha been asking me all week, are you going to dress up? What are you going to be? What are you going to be? And I kept telling her, I'm not finna go buy no costume. Like, I'm not buying no costume. I'm going. I'm finna have fun. And I'm just gonna be what I am. But she was like, no, you need to quit being a party pooper. And you're gonna get something. She was like, even if I gotta buy it, you're gonna be something. So I was like, fine. When I was in Target the other day, I saw these giant, um, these giant villain heads. They had like Medusa. They had the, um, the villain from Snow White. They had Mickey Mouse, Minnie Mouse. And it's these like oversized, um, mask heads. So I was going to go in there and get one of those because they like $20, $25, something like that. And I was like, okay, I could just put on all black and then just put that on. But then when I got over there in the Halloween section, uh, when I got off work today, I saw they had um, this little like face mask stuff. And I was like, oh, okay, well, I could just try to do something creative with that. So I saw these little um, tattoos. I know y'all can't really tell exactly what's going on, but these are supposed to be like um, stitches or whatever. And I was like, oh, I could be like a scary baby doll because I knew I had like this little baby doll top and um, like a little fringy type of skirt. So um, hopefully because this is at like a clubhouse. So hopefully they got a full body mirror so y'all can get the whole look. But, um, and then I did these two oversized bowls. I found these bowls in the Halloween section for pets. These are actually two bow ties for a, a small dog. And I was like, yes, I can use those for my little hair bows. And then I just put, 
uh, one of my old ratted tatted wigs and um in two ponytails so yeah i am a um a scary baby doll yeah i did that i'm kind of excited that i actually participated so carisha will be pleased because she was irritated with me that i wasn't gonna dress up um i forgot what she said she was gonna be because she done named about 10 different things that she was supposed to be this week she done went from wonder woman to a skeleton to a scarecrow to uh wakanda the um incredibles listen carisha has done a lot she's done a lot but um yeah nevertheless we're here so um I'm going to get myself situated and then hopefully if the lighting is lighting when I get in here, once I see the setup, I'll definitely bring you guys with me because my cousin don't mind. This is my cousin party and she definitely won't mind me vlogging. So, yeah, let's go. Come and talk to me. I really want to meet you, girl. I really want to know your name. Right, and just like that we have moved on into Sunday I have managed to crawl up out the bed because I would not miss this event for the world now if y'all have heard me say this name 50 million times on my channel I am talking about my girl Rocky um, of course everything in life is unexpected and unfortunately um, she had to go through a breast cancer journey hence all the pink that you see in the room but my girl was a trooper the whole way um, and she even went as far as to document a lot of her journey and she shares her experience on her social media so I'm gonna drop her information right here you guys can go follow her on Instagram at frecklefacecutie underscore 74 and you can also follow her on TikTok 
where she has a lot of her breast cancer journey and on TikTok she is just freckle face and she's hilarious and gorgeous on top of that so anyway that was my Sunday me and baby went to this event and we had a really good time she had good music good food and by the way speaking of good food the name of the place where we're at right now is called nibbles and it's located in powder springs georgia and that was my first time in and me and baby really enjoyed the food their macaroni and cheese is called like macaroni pie so um i had the macaroni pie and their cabbage and whatever and um and it was just really good but they have more than caribbean food they have tacos they have sliders they have some bomb drinks oh my god if y'all see i don't see the waitress in the background there but anyways um they got a bomb ass bartender but guys this was today's vlog so i hope you look it up wind it up wind it up <laughs> i hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog and i will certainly catch you in the next one if you made it this far down in the video you already know i love your life and you already know i want you to be happy be healthy be safe and i also want you to check them titties girl this is your girl p hope and i will catch you in the next video bye guys